Hi everyone, this is Andy. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are going to teach you how to use AI and NNN to automatically generate your customized resume in different styles for your job search. We got this idea from our community members. Thank you so, so much. By the way, feel free to share with us the workflow that you would like us to automate in our free any no code community as well. See you there. Okay, so let's do a quick demo now. All right, let's have the founder of NNN, Jan, as our example. We're going to make some resumes for him. So this is his LinkedIn profile, and this is his GitHub profile. We're going to use this AI agent to collect information from his LinkedIn and GitHub page, then generate his resume in different styles. Let's click the chat button. Hi. What styles do you have? Okay, let's do the macchiato style first. Okay, for the GitHub username, let's go to the URL and then paste this for LinkedIn. We go to the URL and copy and paste this. Let's wait for a while. Great, let's take a look at the resume first. So this is style, and an founder, open source project, education. Let's check here. Great. It's correct. So let's try another style. Okay, what style we have? Um, let's try another style, please. Uh, we choose try even as the theme. Okay, let's provide to GitHub and LinkedIn again. Great, let's take a look at this. Now nice. this is another style with the LinkedIn profile picture here. Great work. And then founder, education, projects, skills, languages, interests. Great. So um, this is the quick demo of how you can use it. And I will share with you how you can build this on your own as well. Let's dive in. All right, first of all, we have this when chat message received as the trigger, which means this chat here. We can use WhatsApp chat, um, Telegram chat, or uh, Slack chat, etc. You can put it, just change the uh, trigger. And then we are going to search for AI agent. We use this here. And this time we are going to use um, the um, tool agent here. We are going to define the prompt below. This is a text, just uh, drag and drop here and drag here like this and put it here, okay? As for the system message, we can put you or a resume generator AI agent. You can use the following tools, get GitHub profile, GitHub repo, LinkedIn profile crawler, generate resume, PDF, etc. And we need to prepare a JSON schema, detailed content of the job summary, and then ensure all information is factual and based on real candidates experience include all educational uh, education and professional details and this is a json schema and i will let you know where to use this json schema later you can just copy and paste this json schema okay and then finally we re uh, return the pdf url to the user all right so that's it for the ai agent part and for the chat model we are going to use open ai we use uh, GPT-4 Mini. We can change it to other uh, model as well. But for this demo purpose, we just use uh, 4 Mini. And we will have other tools. All right, for the tool, we will have HTTP request tool here. We can click this. And then we can go inside and then rename it to get get a profile because it is for getting get a profile by um, the, uh, inputting the username. You can just copy and paste this use, this URL. As for the username, we will get it from 
in the chat when peop, uh, when the um, user input the GitHub username. As for this, it's the same. Basically, just rename it, rename the HTTP request node as a tool to get GitHub repo. Again, you can copy this URL as well for getting the repo of the specific user. And we are going to crawl the LinkedIn profile here. It is a LinkedIn profile crawler, and this time we are going to use Apify. Okay, we're going to use an, one of the um, actors provided by the Apify. And we need to use generic credential type, query auth. Um, we have the Apify key here. So basically, we go to um, credentials of NNN and then choose query auth, put token, and then paste your Apify um, API key here. Then you can use it. As for the JSON, it's very simple. Just profile URLs, LinkedIn, and then LinkedIn username. Again, for the username, um, the user will have to type in the chat as well. And then here, we're going to use the tool called Core NA Workflow 2, this one. And then we are going to rename it to generate and save resume. We are going to pass the JSON to this tool to generate and save resume. So for the workflow ID, this one. Basically, this is the workflow ID. So as we have the workflow in the same page here, we can just use this, all right, and paste it here. Just copy this workflow and paste it here. And by the way, the field to res return, we need to have the response. So that's why we need to have this as a response. I'll talk about this later as well. All right, we need to add the execute workflow trigger so that when the air agent call this workflow, this will be triggered. We search for execute workflow here. Okay. And then we add another HTTP request node here, this one. What is the purpose of this one? It is calling the any local API. You can use it for free. Um, we we have uh, provided different template styles for the resume. First of all, you can go to any no code documentation query resume, and this is um, the query resume API. Okay, so we have all the documentations here. We have two styles now. If you would like to have more different styles, you can just let me know. All right, so let's take a look at the um, settings here. We can rename it to ending no code API. Okay, you can use it for free again. You can use it for free. And we use post method, just copy and paste this um, URL, query resume, and gen generic credential type query auth. Again, we use query auth here. Uh, any no code API. Just uh, paste the API key uh, as your name, and where we can find the API key, we go to API details, and then just copy and paste this one. Copy this, and then paste it here. Again, we need to use query auth here. All right, and then we enable the send body here. JSON using body, JSON query. Um, again, why we need to have the JSON schema in the AI agent node here is for this node. It's for API, uh, any local API to process everything so that uh, we can use the API to uh, make the resumes and different styles uh, for all of you. Great. Again, you, you can use it for free. And we will have another HTTP request node here. All right. As for downloading the file, we use get method, um, JSON data URL, and then none as the authentication. All right. And last but not least, we will have the Google Drive here because we would like to upload everything. So connect with your um, Google Drive, and then um, your file as a resource, upload as the operation data, as the input data field name, parent drive, my drive, parent folder, and, and demo. 
So for example, this one, we store everything here. Let's refresh. Oh yeah, we store everything here. For the last note is for returning the response to the AI agent. We will have the edit fields here, this one. And then we can rename this to response. Okay. We use menu mapping uh, fields to set which put response, string, and any local API item, JSON data, URL. All right. So basically, it's all set here, and that's how you can uh, uh, build this on your own as well. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Uh, feel free to let me know um, what you think about this and see if this uh, helpful to you guys. And comment below in this video and let me know. See you next time.